In the intricate tapestry of a golfer's game, the choice between an overlap or interlocking grip is a subtle yet consequential decision. Picture it as selecting the brush stroke for your golfing canvases. The overlap grip, a classic choice for many, is a marriage of simplicity and control. It involves the little finger of the trailing hand overlapping the index finger of the lead hand, creating a unified connection. It's a grip that feels natural for numerous golfers, offering a sense of stability and allowing the hands to work in tandem. On the other hand, the interlocking grip, where the little finger of the trailing hand interlaces with the index finger of the lead hand, is a symbiotic embrace. It's a grip often associated with legends like Jack Nicklaus and Tiger Woods. The interlock creates a tighter connection between the hands, fostering a sense of unity in the swing. Now, which is superior? The answer lies in the golfer's preference and comfort. The overlap grip is often praised for its simplicity and adaptability, while the interlocking grip is celebrated for the cohesion it instills. Ultimately, it's a choice that should harmonize with your individual style and feel like a natural extension of your swing. So as you stand on the tee, pondering the grip that will guide your shots, Consider the language your hands speak to the club, whether it's the overlap's simplicity or the interlock's unity. Let the grip be the silent collaborator in the symphony of your swing. In the end, the choice is yours, a brush stroke on the canvases of your golfing masterpiece.